Hey, what's going on guys? It's Combo here today. I'm bringing you guys some Black Ops 2 Wii U gameplay. And if you guys were around yesterday, you would have known that Black Ops 4 is official. It's the next Call of Duty coming and it's tr by Treyarch. So I'm excited that we're getting another Black Ops title. I loved all the Black Ops games and I love Treyarch's Call of Duty games. So I'm excited for it. Um, and here is the official uh, press release or whatever for the game. You guys notice anything? There is no Switch version, that's right. The PS4, Xbox One, and the PS PC were announced in the press release, but the Nintendo Switch version was not. So, um, that was actually kind of not surprising to me, because as, as you guys know, as Call of Duty Nintendo fans, or who have played Call of Duty in the past on Nintendo consoles, you guys would know that they usually don't announce the, um, the game for the Nintendo version, like the Nintendo console. They usually don't announce... The Nintendo version um, at the same time as they announce the other ones. They always, for some reason, wait like a month or two after they announce the the game to say that it's coming to the Nintendo version. So um, I looked around Twitter a little more. Charlie Intel, who is a very reliable Call of Duty source, tweeted out these tweets. Um, this first one here says, Sorry Nintendo fans, you guys are not getting um, Black Ops 4 and they linked it to an Amazon page. So as soon as the game went up, it was available for pre-order on Amazon and Best Buy, and that's what this link is. Charlie Intel tweeted out um, a pre-order link to Amazon where you can select from the Xbox One, the PS4, or the PC version of the game. There is no Switch version. So Charlie Intel um, from that seems to think that we're not getting a Switch version, and they also tweeted this out later. Black Ops 4 is not coming to the Nintendo Switch with a little shruggy face. I reached out to them about this tweet and I said, can you elaborate on this? Did Treyarch confirm no Black Ops 4 Switch? Or did you just assume that we weren't getting a Nintendo Switch version because it wasn't available for pre-order right away? And it does make a difference. Obviously, if we're getting inside news from Treyarch that there is no Switch version, that's one thing. But if they're kind of assuming that since it's not available for pre-order right, right out of the gate, um, then that's not really evidence that we're not getting the game because as you as you guys know it's happened many times before they always announce the game for Nintendo I think they did it for the Wii many times they did it for the Wii U um, they do, they never really announced the Nintendo version until a later date so to me it wasn't a surprise like I said so I did a little bit more digging and I, th I want to thank you guys awesome platter fan Sly McFly and Aug MC and a few other guys reached out to me on Twitter and let me know of these pieces of news from these various sources um, and I was able to get a little bit more information about a possible Nintendo Switch version so awesome platter fan linked me to this tweet here by a guy named Jeff Gordon and he said that Activision declined to comment on a Switch version. They could have easily confirmed that it wasn't coming to the Switch, but they specifically did not. And um, they asked him where he got his source for this, and he got his source from a guy named Jason Schreer from uh, Kotaku. He's a writer for Kotaku. He's verified on Twitter, over 50,000 followers, and in his Kotaku article, which is also another very um, usually credible and reliable source, he said in the last paragraph here, Despite earlier rumors, Activision did not say anything about a Switch release. When asked about the Switch release, the company declined to comment. There is, of course, a Nintendo Direct today, or which was yesterday, at 5 p.m., so if the company does plan to release Black Ops 4, and they they did a little uh, little sarcasm here with the extra, <laughs> the extra Roman numerals there, Black Ops 4 on Switch, it may be waiting for then. So obviously it wasn't announced that the Nintendo Direct but they reached out to Activision for a comment about the Switch version um, to which Activision declined. And this is all familiar stuff if you guys have played Call of Duty on Nintendo consoles in the past. They always kind of say no comment, no comment, nothing, nothing, and then they finally release some information later on a later date. So it's more or less the same thing that we've been getting for the last, I don't know, how many years that Nintendo Call of Duty has been like are we getting it? Are we getting it? Every year we question if we're getting the game or not. Um, but this year I'm feeling a little different. Um, I will definitely keep you guys updated. I'm not going to make a video about every little detail, but I thought this was interesting stuff considering Black Ops 4 was indeed confirmed and, um, you know, no Switch was uh, mentioned, but, you know, they declined to comment. So I wanted to show you guys that. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you guys are doing well. Have a good one. Have a good weekend, and I'll see you all later.